Hey guys, and welcome back to KLW Reptiles YouTube channel. Today, I thought it would be really cool to give you guys a plant haul. Um, I actually am gonna go ahead and include some other footage in this video as well of another kind of mini plant haul that we did. Or maybe it was bigger than this one, I don't know, I can't remember. I've been getting into plants a lot more recently, um, so I'm gonna go ahead and start this. The first one that we have is this Marble Queen Pothos, um, and this comes from Honey Plant. It's actually a local shop to us, and they are in Fort Wayne, Indiana, and so I really like them. Um, they always have beautiful plants, and so I picked up this Marble Queen Pothos. I plan to go ahead and propagate um, a lot of these vines and whatnot and make cuttings out of these. Um, pothos are one of my favorite plants, um, and I have a small um, plant of this already, but it's like a fraction of the size. So I figured let's do this and then we can get some more cuttings out of it and make more plants. This next plant also comes from Honey Plant and this one is a philodendron. Philodendron is probably my favorite um, type of plant and this one is a squamiferium. I don't know if I'm saying that correctly, but one of my favorite things about this plant is that it actually has like some furry um, like growths on the stem, um, or at least I think that's what that's called. I don't know. I'm still, I don't know what the types of parts of plants are just yet. So I will have to learn that. But yeah, I just love that it has all of these really cool, um, like furry type growths on it. I think it's super cool. And they also are, you know, have some red to them as well. Um, but I love the leaf shape as well to this guy. He's got some new growth going up here. So really excited for that, and this is um, just a new leaf as well. And the next plants that I have to show you are actually in this box, and I need to unbox them. These are from Fontanimal Plant House. This is actually the second time that I've ordered for them, and they were actually the first people to ever send me plants before. Hopefully I can include that footage in this video as well, so you guys can get a little bit of a longer video, since this is a bit of a smaller plant haul. Um, at least right now, but let's go ahead and get this box opened. So we're gonna go ahead and unbox this. I have Brandon filming for me, so hopefully it looks good. It looks good? Yes, okay, as good perfect. as I look. Okay, so this is my order from Fontanimal Plant House, and this is their information and whatnot, so you guys can check them out if you want. I really like them. They've been awesome so far. Um, and then they also sent a little card. I think that's super cute. You guys know I just love getting like cute little things. They also sent this too, so I, I just love when people send like really cute things. And I really uh -huh. like that crested gecko picture. Um, if you guys don't know, they actually have crusties and stuff like that too. I think they have other species, but I'm not entirely sure. So let's go ahead and get into this and start opening these guys up. Lots of fluff. I purchased these on their lives, and so I don't entirely recall like what exactly it was that I purchased. Um, I have an idea, but hopefully they labeled them, and it looks like they did. I have, I have them labeled down here, so. They do a really good job of packing, so it's taking me a minute to get these out. So this one here is an, I believe, an Epi Albo, um, and this guy is really interesting. You can come closer if you want. I don't know how close you are, um, but I really like this guy on the live because it has tons of nodes. So if I cut this and propagate it, I should get more little babies, like right here. Um, so I hopefully I can do this properly. This would be the first time I'm ever doing this, but I got it for a good deal. Um, and as far as I understand, as far as care, these guys are really similar to pothos. So I love that they wrapped up these vines for us to protect everything. And it's also um, variegated, so it's an elbow. So really pretty leaves on this one. I will take this off here in a minute, but let's get into the next one. This next one is a philodendron Florida green. And as you guys can tell, it's quite large. So it took me a minute to get it unpacked and it's not even fully unpacked yet. Um, I just wanted to kind of show you guys um, the size of this plant. Um, I do believe that they said and I could be wrong, but this was one of their like mother plants. I might be wrong on that, but let's get all this stuffing off. Oh, and look at that, that's got a cool stem. Um, I think it 
was. Maybe it wasn't. I might be wrong. Um, if it's not, it's just a really, really well established and well taken care of Florida green. So um, I've never had a Florida green before. So really excited to have this one. And I just love the leaf shape on this guy. It was, it was either that this plant was the mother plant and they've um, propagated from it or that it was once maybe that it was variegated and it reverted back maybe that's what it was or something like that i don't know i'm not too savvy with plant terms yet i think i know a little bit but i don't know if i'm using them properly so um hopefully you guys can forgive me if i'm misusing any terms but yeah, look how big that leaf that's is nice yeah. right isn't that so pretty mm -hmm. got it for a steal too so if you guys are looking for beautiful house plants, definitely recommend Fontana or Fontanimal. I want to make sure yeah. that I say this correctly. Fontanimal, I think is how you say it. I definitely recommend them. Um, they've been awesome to work with and they do lives on Instagram. Um, they do stuff on Facebook too. So really excited to have these plants. And let's go ahead and jump into the past footage from my last plant haul. It bothers me whenever I see a lot of people open packages the wrong way. Or what? Like with knives, and they're usually kitchen knives. <laughs> and oh look, it says my name. I feel like a lot of I feel like a lot of kitchen knives aren't sharp. Nice. It's like the one that you were saying earlier that's pretty. Yeah. I see. It's cold. Oh, yeah. But we'll let him warm up to room temperature. Maybe I'll leave this polyfill in there and just let him slowly warm up. And then this is the white wizard. <clears throat> Oh, it's the white one? Yeah, it's the white wizard. Whoa. Look, it's about to pop another. Oh, no, that's the leaf right there. But it is about to pop another leaf right here. See it? Yeah. And it looks like that leaf might be variegated. That's cool. Mm -hmm. 